Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to um, put your um, hard drive from your Xbox 360 into your computer and then get all your game save data off and so on. First things first, what you're going to want is a hard drive transfer cable. So, go to Google, or eBay rather, and then wait for it to load. Type in hard hard drive transfer cable as you can see there's been a lot of searches for it recently wait for it to load and here are um, not too dear that I don't think they look very dear 799 pretty cheap but I don't use the hard drive transfer cable I use SATA power and SATA so you can use SATA power which is SATA cables and plug it into the inside of your computer using a SATA cable and SATA power cable using these them two yep that which is a lot cheaper because that only costs about two pounds then you just need a T6 and a T10 screwdriver wipe that load which is there T6, T10, and then you open your hard drive and plug it in. But that's all really complicated, so I'll just go with hard drive transfer cable. So then what you want to do is go to my website in the description, download um, the tools, and then you want to use Export 360 or Explorer 360. Don't matter, both same. Well, it uh, does it. It does matter, but it doesn't. Because if you got a 20 gig, just use Export 360. If you got 60 gig, 120, use Explorer. Um, anyway, then here you have your partitions. Partitions one and partitions two, you you don't need. That's why I don't let you open on here. But you can open that on Explorer. And then what you want to go to is you've got cache, which is all your updates and so on. Then you've got your content which is user profiles as it says there, saves, stuff like that. Then you're gonna this is gonna look confusing, but that is you download the stuff from Xbox Live, your content, and then here are your profiles. I have three gamer profiles on mine. Then what you wanna do is click on that, click on FF, the ones with loads of F's at the start, then double click there then here, that's your profile, drag it onto your desktop and you've now got it, always make a backup and to check that it's your profile, open up Modio wait for Modio to load wait for that to load and drag it in and I now know that's my, pro that's my picture so I now know that that's my profile which I want and that's how you do it, thanks for watching go to my website in the description watch some more of my um, tutorials and I'll see you later, bye